It has been a long-standing link between um, Leicester and the uh, Diocese of Mount Kilimanjaro, and uh, it's, um, it's a folk of, of, of great health to the Diocese of Mount Kilimanjaro because uh, we are sharing experience from Leicester, um, and sometimes people from uh, DMK went to Leicester, and from Leicester they come here and we share experience. We uh, we have a time to to have a conversation, what they are doing and what we are doing, and we learn a lot. As a, a group we have seen, uh, especially in our cl classrooms, um, they are not uh, proper. We need some rehabilitation and even some renovation. And also we, are, we have another plan that uh, after having primary school here, we are planning to have a secondary school, Form 1 up to Form 4. Yes, and uh, that will be a boarding school so that we can accommodate many students and especially those who are coming from far. Uh, we have this goal of planting 300 churches in the diocese. As you know, the area is vast, so we need to plant more churches. Uh, we have done so far about 150. Uh, we have, so with the, our, the top priority right now is to finish up with the 150 more churches. Obviously, that brings a lot of pressure, so keep on praying. We have created this big, good problem. Uh, there are needs of plots and land to build those new churches the needs for the buildings of the new churches. We have just uh, come up with a new model of church buildings that can, could be built in 15 to 20 days. And this church could cost us about $6,000. And it will house 100, uh, 250 people. You have seen some in Endodosh and uh, Nanalami, those kind of churches. Uh, here, this is a church which we, we just built today. It's 15 days since we started this job. And these people in this area didn't have a place to worship. 
So they've been going under the tree for almost uh, six years. Then later in the diocese, we are bleeding church for low cost. And this it will be done after 22 days. Uh, the demand is very big. So we started with one church, then we see it was not good enough. Then we did four church, it was not good enough. Then this year, we say, let's do more than 10 churches. So anything can happen for 2017. We started four years ago. Bishop Tim opened this with Bishop Stanley Hotte and um, we had a grand opening here and we had five students and now we have 65 students. I wanted to start a Christian school for my kids and for other missionary kids that was affordable in Arusha. I didn't have any funds and I thought how on earth am I going to do this and prayed about it but I opened my Bible and to Isaiah and it said, I will help you. So I thought God's going to help me do it. And he has. We've, we've um, put in about $300,000 that we've raised uh, for these three buildings. And we have um, now preschool, well, nursery up to grade five. The Diocese of Leicester, as a sister diocese to our diocese, we will say, number one, I would say thank you to dear Martin, the Bishop of Leicester Diocese, and all his staff, the clergy, and all the parishes that have partnered with us over the years. One uh, challenge and a request to you is, come and partner with local parishes. Go into this remote and rural diocese or parishes in our country, in our diocese. Uh, we, that way, those people will be encouraged that we are not just ourselves. We have our brothers and sisters that are in England, in Leicester Diocese, that care about us, pray about for us, and work with us in the mission of our Lord.